Hello everyone, welcome to the channel again. Yes, it's another video here at Coopart, Des Moines. Uh, so let's jump guys quickly to the first one, shall we? So here's the first one for you guys. It's a 2016 GMC Terrain. It's the SLT trim level. Uh, it's 2.4, of course, four cylinder. Uh, it has front wheel drive with all wheel drive, I think, or it's like it's all wheel drive. So you can just ignore like the front wheel drive portion of it uh what else do we have it's like uh it has salvage history but not salvage title so probably like it has uh rebuilt title or something like this it has 72,000 miles pre spray tight in here guys so i can't show like this car in a good angle uh it runs and drives it said and it said that uh, it has only minor dents and scratches it has like three accidents According to Epic Vin, this car was involved in three accidents. And it's on Prover right now, and it's currently sitting at $600. So, yeah, let's take a look. We do have some damage in here, guys, like these. You have to fix that. I'm not sure how, but we have to click these backs, but I couldn't. <laughs> okay. Uh, do we have like some damage here? No. Okay, okay. We have like some scratches in here, but nothing serious. Again, like there's nothing seriously damaged in this car. So let's take a look inside, shall we? Uh, yeah, nice leather seats. Smells very good actually here. Okay. Here, that's nice. Okay, let's take a look at the, since we are on it, at the roof. Okay, doesn't look that bad. Actually, it's very good. Okay. All right. So let's see if we have power to turn this car on, see how it runs. Okay. Okay, let's see. Nah, nothing at all. Completely dead. Okay. So let me jump the car. For you guys, right, guys. so back. I just connected my jump pack to the car. But let's check the engine bay, let's check if we have oil in it. We do, uh, yeah, it's not very clean, but we do have oil. Uh, okay, here we go. All right, uh, yeah, there's nothing suspicious here at the engine bay, so it should run. Because they say it turns and drives, so let's see if you have power first. Oh, uh, we do. Okay, hopefully it will start now. Okay, there you go. Alright, started right away. No issues. That's good. That's good. Okay, we don't have check engine light. That's good. Power lift gate switch is off. I have no clue what that means. Alright, but no problems. Let's see, uh, we do have, yeah, we do have actually uh, working radio. Let's check the AC. Okay. Unfortunately, we don't have cold AC, so, yeah. Yeah, it's not running where, like, the AC is not running, actually. Okay, let's take a look in here. Uh, manual, use a manual only. Okay. Uh, no, guys, I take that back, actually. Yeah, here, here you go, like, the AC started, like, to get some, yeah. Yeah, it's getting cold, actually. Now it's ice cold. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. So it's working, guys, no problems. Okay, so what do we have in here? We have lane departure warning, as you can see, and we have, like, collision alert, that's nice. We have cruise control on or off. Okay, so here's, like, the collision alert. Okay, hood is open, so how do you dismiss these? Uh... Let's see. I have no clue. 
how to do that. No, not here. Not this one, not this radio one. Radio is currently powered on. Oh. Please turn on the radio before using the voice recognition feature. Okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how to remove this warning light, guys. Okay, uh, let's see how the engine sounds, actually. But before that, let's check the tailgate, see like if it will open or not. Okay, here you go. But, oh, wow, what is that? <laughs> wow, huh. Wow, we do have like broken stuff in here, guys. So what is this? I have no clue. Okay. Okay. Yeah, as you can see, guys, like this will not work. I have to close it manually. Okay, let's take a look at the engine bay. Yeah, the engine is running smooth and the alternator is charging. So I guess we can disconnect this one here. All right. So probably, guys, this car was involved like in some kind of accident. Undercarriage here, probably. And it was like fixed. That's, that's my speculation on this issue in here. Okay, this warning light's gone now. So let's see, we're going to gear. We do have backup camera. Okay, steering feels good. Brakes feels good. And yeah, sensors and everything is working, no problems. All right, yeah, it's, it's, it's really good, guys. This car is really good, it's like, it's running very nice. I can tell, so yeah, yeah. I was expecting that, uh, but it has salvage, uh, salvage history, so you have to check on like the prior accidents for this car and why, what kind of accident this car was involved in. So, yeah, so here's it for you guys, the 2016 GMC Terrain. So let's move to Hi the guys, one. so the last one here for Copart Des Moines, the main lot, it is going to be a 2009 Civic on the Civic EXL trim level. It has like the 1.8 liters front wheel drive. Uh, it has 165,000 miles. Of course, it has salvage title. The, it said like it turns on drives and they said that the main damage is on the rear, as you can see in here. Uh, it was involved in an accident according to Epic Vin. It's on pure sale, this car, so yeah, that's good. But as you can see, like the damage is real bad in here, guys. But it's sitting currently at zero dollars. No one bid on this car so far. Okay. Uh, so let's take a look at the damage here. What is that? Okay, some stuff. So as you can see, guys, this part of the trunk is actually dented. As you can see in here, the support is dented as well. Probably can need one. The lid for the trunk, the trunk lid is actually destroyed. Uh, but the good thing is, at least like this one here, this fender here, this quarter panel is not damaged. Let's check the other one. Yeah, the other one is not damaged as well. So all I need to do is just like pull this thing out and get a new bumper and new trunk lid for this car. It should be good to go. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad at all. Okay, uh, let's see in general if we do have like any kind of other damage. This one here, well, it's not a big deal. Actually, I can fix it myself. There we go. It's better now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, not bad at all. We do have some roof in here and no damage to the roof as well. Okay, let's take a look inside, shall we? Oh, nice. We do have some stuff in here, like the, yeah, the tail lights, but one of them is broken. How about the other one? Yeah, the other one is a better shape. Okay. We do have leather seats. Oh, nice. Okay, for a Civic, that is really nice. Leather seats. Okay, that's pretty good. All right, let's see if we have power in here. Wow, this car is like kind of like full loaded because we have like this uh, infotainment system. I'm not sure if we have like uh, navigation or not, but we'll check that in a minute. User manual, nothing else. That's good. Okay. Um, I bet you guys there's no power in this car. Yeah, 
dead, completely dead. Okay, so let me jump the car. I'll come All back. Alright guys, so I just connected the jump pack in here. So uh, let's check the engine bay actually. Uh, yeah, there's nothing suspicious in here. Let's check the oil. Do we have oil? Uh, we do. It doesn't look like we have much of it, but we do have some oil in it. Let's take a look at this one here. Yeah, looks like we do have oil, guys, so we'll just try to start the car right now if we do have, of course, power. All right, let's see. Do we have power in here? Okay, I can see we do have power because this one is illuminating. All right, so let's see. Okay. All right, there you go. All right, great. Let's see what kind of uh, warning lights we have. So far, nothing. That's interesting. Other than like the trunk is open because it's damaged. That's why it's gonna be always open until like you uh, fix it. Both doors are open, or is just like this door? Let's see. Yeah. Okay. I see. All right. So let's check this uh, unit in here. Uh, is it Dutch? Looks like it is. Do we have... Uh, what is that? Why this one's not working, this? Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure, guys, how do you... Oh, nice. Nice. That's really nice. I'm wondering, guys, is that like... Uh, Oh, <laughs> okay, code. We don't have the code. Let's try like zeros. Done, maybe? No. Yeah, unfortunately I can't show you, but it's very nice. It's very nice. Okay, let's see if we have AC. Oops, no, this one. Yeah, guys, I have no idea how these Japanese cars, once you start the AC, you get like ice cold AC. This is, this is boggling my mind, guys. Because all of my cars are actually German. <laughs> and they, like, it took them a while, it took my cars a while to, like, get cold AC. But this, these cars, immediately, you get, like, the cold AC immediately. Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice. Okay, all right. Cool, cool. So you have cold AC. So... Yeah, let's see how the engine sounds. Uh, let's give it like a couple of revs first. Okay. Uh, we do have like, we do have smoke, but probably this is because of uh, maybe from sitting and it's just like steam. Cause it doesn't like, it doesn't look like it's uh, like a blue smoke or white smoke it's kind of white but it looks like it's kind of steam not not like burning oil or something also the engine is running smooth it's very smooth in here all right so yeah i'm confident guys from this car i am confident uh let's take a look again here yeah it's getting better now yeah yeah so probably this is just steam guys from for the scarf from run, like sitting and tr not not running. Yeah, let's see. Uh, okay, parking brake is working. Yeah, it's very nice in here. Uh, let's see, guys, if it will go into gear now. Okay, steering feels good. Uh, brakes, they feel pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, it's running pretty good. This car. You have to check like the code for this uh, unit, navigation unit. But other than that, it's in pretty nice shape, guys. Leather seats, fully loaded. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty nice. Let's turn it off. Let's see if it will turn on again. Nah, okay. The battery is weak, but that's all, guys. Nothing else. So yeah, guys, uh, so you just have to make sure that how much this damage will cost you to fix other than that. It would make a nice car for someone. It would make a nice deal driver. 
All right, guys, so there's it for you guys, the 20, 2009 Honda Civic EXL. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, please, guys, uh, hit the like button if you like what you see. If you'd like to see more, please, guys, subscribe to the channel because this will help me a lot uh, to make, like, a better content for you guys. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you next week, guys, and thanks for watching. See ya.